for most of the day here. Good morning comrades, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to Neuvokrain, to Apex. Such a sunny, wonderful day and what makes this day even more wonderful is this van over here. The white van and we have a plan for this van. We're namely gonna put the Pro Truck wheels with AR1 tires in it and install it on the Yaris. But there is a lot more as the title of this video suggests because we are bringing the Yaris to Monti Racing where they're going to install the new KW suspension and endless brake pads. So first up, let's load up the wheels and then pick up the Yaris. Oh, don't want to get in your way. So what we have here is, let's see, dum -dum -dum, I think it's 265s, just to be sure, yeah. 265, 35, 18 square setup. That should be nice and beefy. Light enough to carry it with one hand. Okay, we're good. Load it up. Let's go. These ones, front and back. Exactly. Okay, ME20s, that's what we're putting on. Cool, let's go. Let's go. Come on! <laughs> there we go. <laughs> right, while we're waiting for the gate to open up, we are here at Breitscheid, the second entrance and exit of the Nürburgring Nordschleife at Touristenfahrten. Now, today Nürburgring published sort of a press release when it comes to this weekend, so I'm gonna take this opportunity to tell you more about it. The entrance will and exit will remain closed of Breitscheid. You are allowed to park at uh, Pflanzgarten, at uh, Brünchen, at uh, some other parking areas, but only come here if you're intending to drive. Speaking of driving, only two people are allowed in the car uh, of the same household, and that's pretty much it. So stay safe, stay awesome, and let's get Yaris now to Monte Racing. By the way, it's shining a lot because it has received some care package, some detailing. But even though it looks shiny and nice, I'm pretty sure you guys want to see something else. So let's hop in and go to Monte Racing. Hello again, long time no see. Mm, it's getting busier here, in comparison to the last time I saw it. Hey look, it's Tila's Cupra, and something's getting toothed. That was two years ago the cage was in the, in the GTX, two years. Oh, that's <laughs> That for us? Yeah. Fancy. How many adjustments is enough? We'll see. <laughs> we hope it's a lot. Just to avoid the taking off the line that does the washer fluid, might as well just leave this cover on here. I doubt that the rally version is as difficult when it comes to changing suspension. Yeah. <laughs> Shots, angles. The main difference is, of course, that this comes with m multiple adjustments. It's a three way adjustable suspension, together with also camber adjustment on the top. So, quite a difference for the stock one. So, while the front shocks are being installed, let me give you a quick explanation of uh, what the KW three-way suspension actually means. So what type of settings does it involve? So it has 
the low speed compression, the high speed compression, and low speed rebound. What does this mean? It's basically not the faster you go, but it depends on how fast the suspension is traveling up and down. So in case of low speed uh, compression, it's like when you're going over a smooth bump, over very smooth elevation changes, and a high speed, this means a very abrupt, um, like a tra suspension travel uh, direction, uh, basically when you're going over a curb stone. So these two settings uh, allow you to uh, modify, to, to adjust it. And then in addition, a low speed rebound. So how fast or how slow the suspension is traveling back. And in addition, you can also play with the spring rates, something that Manta Racing will do for us. And finally, of course, it offers the camber adjustment, which the st stock suspension doesn't do. So in theory, you have basically probably, I would say even four to five settings if you would really name the every difference that you can change in comparison to the stock suspension. And the stock suspension is basically just a compromise to offer you the comfort, but also the handling. And here we can go really track focused with it. So very much looking forward to do the laps in the upcoming, yeah, in two days time. Hopefully the weather will be okay. Although today it's sunny, but um, they predict snow in two days. But after that it should be sunny again. But anyhow, let's continue with the installation. Yeah. So here you have the high speed compression and low speed compression. And on top you have the rebound settings over here. And in addition, the camber plates. And the same goes for the rear. So high speed compression, low speed compression, and then the rebound adjustments over here. Ah, <laughs> quite some comparison stock rear. KW rear. The suspension is installed on the back, on the front, and now it is time to move on onto the brakes. So brake lines and brake pads. With the brake lights installed, it's now time to put in the Racing Superfood RF650 by Endless. Well, that's pretty much it for today's video. The guys still need to do the right side of the car, also pump the brake fluid, so to put the brake pressure back on, well, the brake on the pressure. Uh, it is already the end of today's uh, working day, I would say. So uh, I'm gonna go home, uh, edit this video, uh, so you can watch it today still. Tomorrow we will be back because then we'll be doing the alignment of the Yaris and maybe taking it out on the road. Well, for sure taking it out on the road, but it's not going to be as exciting as driving it on the track. But that, as mentioned previously, hopefully this upcoming weekend you would, won't have to wait long. Um, that's pretty much it. The only thing I want to say is that you can get endless brake pads here at Manta Racing. Also KW Suspension, they're official dealer of both the products. They can also install it for you, as you can see. And, and it doesn't matter if it's a very fast Cupra, the M2, the Yaris, or even uh, well, some of more 
luxury cars. Anyway, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm very excited for tomorrow and again this weekend. And that's all I have to say for today. See you tomorrow. Bye.